Hello, hello, hello. So this is my true, this uh my choose your adventure game presentation, and and I created this in Python. And the theme of this choose your adventure is that you're lost in a dark and creepy forest. So the story is that you wake up and you see yourself in a dark and creepy forest. You look around your surroundings and see nothing special. You keep walking forward and suddenly you get knocked out. After a while, you wake up and suddenly it's raining. You keep running forward until you see a house at a distance. Dot dot dot. And your goal is to find a way out of this forest. And this is the answer key up here if you ever get lost. I did this from diagrams.net. So let's start. So in order to start, you just press this run button and boom, you should receive this message. And yeah, there are two choices you can do. The first choice is just for the save function. You know, to load and yeah, not load. So if you press E, then yeah, there are no saves. So let's start. Uh, move base cam up here, and yeah, let's go inside. The, uh, yeah, let's go inside the house. And here you can choose to save. So let's save and let's do. Um, let's try to break the door. And let's try to run. And then if I load save, boom, I'm over here. Yeah, to where I last saved. which is a uh, one cool feature another feature is that if we go over here and yeah you can see it's on a different account you know so yeah another thing another cool thing about the save feature is this let's assume I save up here and now we're gonna leave that and we'll go back to code and uh, the same account in uh, yeah, Google Chrome. And yeah, now if I just go back to load save, if I go break the door, and I can load back save, boom, I'm back. So it's kind of like a local save in a way, which is pretty cool. And yeah, another feature, we're going back over here. Let's just clear this and restart it. So if you go inside the house and try to break the door and run, you go to the basement. And if you choose the one stake, this is a 50-50 chance. So you have to choose either one or two. So yeah, so flip and I lost. And yeah, if you ever get deafening, you will receive a quote. So there's this one over here, you can see. And once you, yeah, once you reach the ending, you'll get this message where you can choose to quit or restart. Just go quit right over there. And yeah, that's mostly all the features. Um, so I'm just going to show everyone all the endings. Here we go. So... Ending one is you can get out and as far around and you can go to attic and yeah if you attack the vampire you you'll die. Just don't be afraid to make mistakes, but if you do make new ones, life is too short to make a wrong choice twice. And then we'll go back here and this time we'll go, go here, explore around. We'll go to attic, but this time we'll go to the garage. Boom. And I found the car and I drove out this place. Done. That's two endings in the row. You can choose to explore around, but this time it goes to the washroom. So let's see over here. So I can choose a screen in which I type because, yeah, the vampire knows that. And you'll receive this quote. Pretty cool. Let's just reset that and, and load save. I'm back over here and I'll work my way out. And yeah, over here, let's go to the garage and boom. Load save and I can choose to find a way out. Bedroom. And then, yeah, I got it. And this is the quote you will get. All right, let's continue. 
can we already exploring around, so let's try to break the door. And if I look behind myself, then yeah, I died. And this is the quote you get. Do pretty reasonable. Let's restart back again. Inside the house, break the door, run, and safe because I don't want to restart back in. Bedroom and yeah. Got this one. I'm a human, not perfect. Like anybody else. This ending bright gosh. Yeah, it's self synchronized if you go over here. As I'm going to wash room and checking the bedroom. Yeah, it's exactly the same thing. Interesting. Um, let's try to break the door, run, and let's go to the basement. Now we all know the stake, it's a 50 50, and a shotgun. We can try it right now. Yeah, you man, you kill the you, with the shotgun. You can kill the vampire instantly because yeah, it's a shotgun, <laughs> obviously. And then once you kill the vampire, the you can check. Yeah, you check on the vampire, and the vampire has a map in which you managed to escape. Get the steak and two two. And yeah, this is a death ending if you lose the 50 50. Let's try it. Get lucky again. Take one. Yes. So yeah, this is a good ending if you manage to get lucky. Let's just uh, quit. Let's run this again. Now since we finished all the options for A, let's go to B. For B, I can choose to keep running or see if I can fix the truck. Let's choose to keep running and uh, yeah. Now I can make a sign in the middle of the road or stand in the middle. Yeah, stand in the middle of the road. I'm just going to save this and let's stand in the middle of the road. And yep. You will get this quote. If you stand in the middle of the road, you often learn more by being wrong for the right reasons than you do by being right for the wrong reasons. Now, luckily, we have a slow save, so we're gonna just see and then back. And yeah, you receive this if it's successful. Now, let's make a sign and yeah, reach the ending. Over here. Oh. Oh. Um, going this direction. Let's see if it's the truck. Save. And now, let's see. And boom. We reached the ending. And the final one, which is, yeah. The stream sound in. Future curiosity. <laughs> you ever see this quote? Which is from World of Warcraft, by the way. Yeah, that is everything. All the endings. And so, you might be wondering how the save function works. Which is over here. And, yeah. Every time you will, you will want to save, you will... Uh, it will, yeah, write down. Write down, for example, if this is Power X, I'll write down X. Close that file and send that message in. Yeah. And on this load save uh, function, it will load the save. And this is to check if the user has any saves. If no, then I'll print this error message. And if yes, you know, if there is saved, then check the final number and see, yeah. And check all these. If the message is B, if the last number is B, then teleport to B. If it's X, then yeah, teleport to start these functions. The answer key, the yellow square equals to the start area. The red equals to the death endings. Purple is a 50-50, and the green is the good ending. And that should be about it. Goodbye.